All right, hey peeps, it's Dee, and I am making another Sticky Note to Self Sunday video for you, and this one is all about resistance. Now, before I get into this video, I want to give a shout out to Gallery 210 at the University of Missouri in St. Louis, uh, which is hosting right now the first showing of all the black notes from the Sticky Note to Self project. If you are in the St. Louis area, definitely feel free to go by UMSL, check out Gallery 210, and it's taken it to the streets uh, exhibition that's on, uh, on view until May, and see my work uh, as well as some other amazing artists in St. Louis featured in that gallery space. And one of the works that I have on view at Gallery 210 is the sticky note that simply says, resist. Now typically, I would pull a note off the wall and present it to you, but because that one is in the show, I can't do that. So, here's a photo of a print of it. I wanted to share this video primarily because in my life, there have been a lot of conversations that are all about resistance and what does resistance look like uh, in the, the current political times, in the current social times. And uh, for, for me, you know, resistance is to reject the notions that we have to believe what our political leaders say they want us to believe and how they want us to behave and feel. Um, I resist that I have to herald a president who is not for my life and not for people who, are, who look like me and live and have lived experiences like I do. I don't believe that I have to support him. That's resistance finding any and every way that I can to make sure that I am not giving into the, the fascism, the, the, all the phobias and isms that uh, this administration is, is cultivating through its media and through its messaging to the American people and the globe. As I said in my last video, I also believe that love is resistance in and of itself. And so I, I feel like the more ways and more opportunities that we can uh, create and the more spaces that we can create in order to foster and facilitate love across differences and love across um, each other's experiences and, and meet each other where, where we are and get to know each other. I think that's how we build our momentum and link our arms uh, metaphorically in order to fight against a lot of the um, oppressive, uh, systems and rules and legislation that uh, is developing right now. I also feel like resistance means jumping into uh, a lot of the political realms, running for office, even as an artist, as a young person, as whatever or whoever you are, like taking your, your views and grounding that as political strength and voice, mobilizing people towards uh, the vision, the better vision uh, that you see for the world. There are numerous ways that uh, we all can activate ourselves right now. And also my team at FoodSpark, foodspark.org, recently hosted a potluck dinner conversation that was all about this, this word resistance and what does it mean. If you go to foodspark.org or check out any of our conversation guides, you can use those to host and gather your friends and community members to have conversations with guided questions, resources, insights from other participants as well. So check that out and in the comments below, leave some resources, leave some articles, and share some of your thoughts about what does resistance look like to you. And as always, I post Sticky Notes to Self Sunday videos on Sundays, but in the meantime, take care, make time to reflect, and get to know yourself. Peace.